Background maps, often referred to as base maps, are more than just backdrops. They form the foundation for geographic visualization, providing crucial context for data overlays and analysis. Choosing the right base map is a pivotal decision in GIS projects, as it establishes the tone for the entire visualization. In Felt, accessing base maps is simple. It provides a variety of common backgrounds that fit different visualization requirements. These cover standard choices such as the default background and a light version, which uses more white shades for better visibility. This option is handy when you need the background to be subdued and neutral. You also have a dark mode, offering a different visualization choice, which can be useful for projects that need contrast or nighttime visualization. Additionally, Felt offers a satellite imagery background, providing high resolution, photographic detail that is useful for various purposes. In this case, it complements a vector layer showcasing the historical evolution of a city, offering additional context to understand the changes over time, including the development of buildings and infrastructure. Sometimes you might want to highlight specific elements of your background map. To aid in this, Felt provides a tool that enables you to position layers below both water and roads, essentially utilizing layers from the same map to place beneath another polygon layer. This feature proves invaluable while working with and creating your own background maps as it saves considerable time compared to manually uploading and styling those layers. In addition to the existing options, other background maps are available on the internet that can be accessed via URLs. Adding these in Felt is pretty simple. Just copy the URL, go to the Backgrounds Overflow menu, and select Add from URL. Then paste the URL and it will appear. This functionality is facilitated by the Slippy Maps architecture, which serves as a foundation for building mapping applications on the web, as it provides an efficient way to browse and visualize large amounts of raster and vector map data. To learn more about GIS, follow us.